Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the perspective of our image using depth map in GIMP. So let's get started. First, we need to create the depth map. And this is the depth map for this image. Now, this is not perfect depth map, but the concept of the depth map is the portion which are closest to the camera is in light gray color and portion which are farther away to the camera is dark in color. For example, the background of the image is in dark color and the tip of the nose is in light gray color so let's get into the video first open gimp and drag and drop your subject image inside the gimp and create a new layer and fill it with black color so this black layer will be our background layer and hide this layer now again create a new layer and select the path tool and draw the path around our subject Our subject is closer to the camera so I'm gonna paint it with the gray color I'm gonna paint it with darker gray color and portion of the face is closer to the camera than the body so I'm gonna draw the path around the face using the path tool and select from path using the shortcut key shift plus V and fill it with lighter gray color than the body and again I'm going to select the eye region shift plus V to select from path and I'm going to fill it with lighter gray than the face and I'm going to select the mouth region and I'm going to also paint it with the same grey color and again I'm going to select the nose region and paint it with the same grey color and I'm gonna select the nose tip which is closer to the camera and paint it with a lighter gray color than the others So this is the basic for creating the depth map. This is not the perfect depth map, but you can create the perfect depth map using this technique. Then merge down the top layer with the bottom black layer and our depth map is created. Now go to filters, blur, Gaussian blur and give the blur of approximately 10. And hide this depth map layer and select our subject image layer and go to filters map displays and change both the aux input to depth map and unlink this chain and if we change the horizontal and vertical displacement value we can see the change in perspective don't make the horizontal and vertical displacement value too far that will distort the image so go up to the value that is not distorting the image and then click on ok Now we can see the before and after. We just slightly change the perspective of the image. If we create the perfect depth map, we can achieve better result. But this is not the perfect depth map. So we can only achieve the small change in perspective. So that's it guys. This is the way you can change the perspective of our image using depth map in GIMP. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more future tutorials. Also press the bell icon so that you can get quick notification when I upload your video. Thanks for watching. Bye.